Hello, hello. Now I just put my camera on the swings so this video can be swingy, wiggly, so bear with me. Enjoy it if you will. Dance to it if you will. But now I have very, very relevant message for those who are devoting to their heart's path, to their dharmic path who are aligning to the timeline of ascension, expansion, unity consciousness. So I feel that in this time it's very, very relevant to notice the balance between structure and intuition or time and space in order to experience your life path in the most smooth, harmonious and enjoyable way. It is very, very relevant to find that sense of balance between these two main aspects of your life path. So let's explore those aspects. So time and structure is what you are planning, what is your vision, your schedule, your discipline to accomplish what you really desire to accomplish in your life. So that's very important to have certain structure, to have a clear vision. And space and intuition is space of intuition. It is being spacious, being opened to various nuances, to spontaneity, to playfulness, creativity, so you can always adapt to changes in your life and you can always upgrade your structure, your vision. So as you can see, both of those aspects are very complementary. They support each other. They naturally lead one to another. So only when we hold certain attachments or limiting beliefs, biases, so we can, uh, we can swing to extremes and to ignorance. But it is very good to explore also th those imbalances to get, to get that sweet sense of balance. So for example, imbalance in structure or time is when you're creating too much rigid structure, you are attaching to various expectations on what and when and how you need to accomplish, how everything needs to be moving in your life. So when you are too much attached to your structure, you can create lots of stress, lots of conflicts when life doesn't meet your expectations. You can feel like you are missing out or you, you are creating too much tension, too much rush, and then you are burning yourself out. So then, yeah, it is always wise to invite more spaciousness into your experience, more openness, to slow down to open up, to remember that you are eternal and infinite being that is creating this experience of linear time in this timeless here and now. So then you can move through your structures, you can upgrade your structures and move through your structures in the more smooth, flexible, and blissful way. Because, yeah, if you 
are creating very rigid tower as you you know in the tarot cards where is a card called tower where lightning strikes that tower and everything falls down so instead of being that rigid tower be like a very very flexible and adaptable tree which is alive again alive to this alive moment which is always new always fresh and contains infinity but if you for example are too much biased in the realm of space and intuition that intuition that healthy intuition actually can turn into toxic impulsiveness when you are feeling like you are being pulled into many directions at the same time and when you get confused you get lost in that vastness of possibilities and again impulses and and you are not really accomplishing anything that has that has long-lasting value in your life or for others so then yeah it is wise to invite more structure into that maybe to write down your vision to write down your core intention and then branching intentions and what structure can support those intentions yeah you you, you need to invite the discipline and uh, and yeah and then you can again return to that sweet balance and uh, and yeah it is always always a live dance always balancing dance between those two aspects so you need to find that middle path that is best for you that feels best for you and yes yeah, sometimes there are times when you need more space or you need more time okay this yeah sometimes you need more structure more more focus more discipline and then other times you need more more space more openness maybe to meditate more and so on and sometimes it is something really in the middle so yeah it is always changing always flexible always alive so you just need to notice th those aspects and then you can really start to feel that sense of balance between them in your life so i wish this message will benefit you in creating most epic and wonderful experience of your life and now i will i will give space for children <laughs> who waits for the swing and yeah enjoy it bye